What a wonderful morning this is. Hi, boys and girls, Miss House again. Welcome to Fun Friday. Look at what I have here. Let me show you. Do you see that letter S, A, L, L, Y? It says Sally, it's hidden. It's a hidden name. If I put it over here, can you see it? It's just a blob, but you can hold it up close. It's in a hidden message. All right, I'm gonna show you how you can do one at home. All you need is a white crayon, a little cup of water, a paintbrush, and some paint. Okay, what am I gonna write here? Hmm, it's gonna be a hidden message for you guys. Here we go. All you do is you write your hidden message there. You can draw circles, you can draw squares, you can draw your name, anything that you want to hide and it's hidden. And then you're going to get your paintbrush, dab a little bit of water, put it in the paint. Let's see what I wrote. See, you see any shapes or letters or what do you see here? Do you see it, boys and girls? Do you see it? F-U-N spells fun. Are you having fun? Let's do it again. See? All right. Here's my white collar, remember. Let's see. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Let's see what happens. This one was brown. See my color brown? This one is red, yellow, orange, and green. Let's see what happens if I put black and green. Let's see. Are you ready for my hidden message? You see it? Do you see it, guys? What is it? A, B, C, D. Did you like that, boys and girls? Let's make it darker. Let's make it darker. Here we go. You can do anything with this hidden names, hidden alphabet, shapes, anything you want. Boys and girls, what else can we use this paint for? I just thought of something, but I don't have a straw. I need a straw for this activity. I can use a paper. We can use a paper to make a straw. Hmm, let's see, how can we make it into a straw? Yeah, what about we roll it? Roll it, start at the corner, and let's roll it. made a straw. Are you ready for my next activity? Okay, boys and girls, this is our next activity with just using your paint. And remember my straw that we made? All right, are you ready? Look at what I'm gonna do. You could do this at home. Just a little dot. Then you use your straw to blow it. And then you can put some more paint. Here you go. See what's going on there? Use different colors. You can make designs. You can put a little more paint on there. Blowing into your straw. See? Yeah. 
finished product, see, I just make different designs, kind of like a collage, but using paint. And you can make as many prints as you want. I wanted to make animal prints. What do you think? Do you like this? And another thing you can do, boys and girls, with the leaves outside, you can dab your paint and paint over some leaves and make some prints. You can also put paint on your leaf, see? Just kind of paint your leaf. Place it on the paper and let it dry for a few seconds and then lift it up. There's all kinds of things you can make with paint. A lot of fun. Another activity you can do with your paint and your little bit of water here in the cup, we use scotch tape. I put scotch tape with my letter H. It's invisible. You can barely see it, but there's an H with my tape. Okay, you use your paint. And let's see what happens if we use the paint. The scotch tape. What do you see? What are you beginning to see? <gasps> A hidden letter. See it? Letter H. <sighs> My letter H. You can put your letter A or S, whatever your letter is. Use your tape. Take a little bit out and trace out your letter. Okay, boys and girls, let's look and see how many creations we did with our paints today. Okay, boys and girls, let's see what we did by just using paint. And you got these on your little bag in your home task. A little cup of water, scotch tape, and we made our own straw, remember? And a white crayon, and you got crayons on your in your bag too, I believe. See, look at our hidden words and our animal prints, our leaf prints, and our hidden letter. Did you like all these activities we did today? You can do them tomorrow, maybe. All righty, thank you. I wish you well. Bye bye.